Hi crafters and welcome to the May's 100 cartridge blog hop which is over at the My Cricut Craft Room and I am Candace and um my blog is steppingpearls.blogspot.com um today I have a project for you for the um 100 um the May hundred cartridge block hop. If you don't know what that is, um, on my Cricut Craft Room, every month, every, I think it's the first weekend, or is it the second weekend? I think it may be the second weekend of every month, there is a block hop showcasing a hundred, um, different Cricut cartridges. Um, so for my projects, I am using um, teen scene, um, the new paper dolls, um, teen scene. I am also going to make, be making a project using the Cricut Imagine, um, Best Friends and, um, Baby Boutique. But on this video, it's only going to be, um, teen scene. I also added in a few other cartridges that I need to actually, um, I'm pre-filming this video. So, it's, uh, so by the time you see this, it will be May, but it's April right now. Um, so I need to go back and I need to add, if um, no other design team members took these cartridges, um, berries and cream and um, formal occasion. So I will be using five different Cricut cartridges. But everybody has to use at least um, three. So I'm going to be making a scrapbook um, layout. Um, I actually found... <laughs> I went through some pictures and I found my prom picture from 1999. So, um, I'm actually going to scrapbook that. So, we're going to get started. The paper pack that I am using is uh, Die Cuts with the View Street Lace. This is the, um, the solid colored word, um, pack and then this is from the, um, the pattern cardstock pack. It's going to be a 12 by 12 layout and I have so much stuff on this table that I have things falling and I am um, and this piece here is um, cut down to 11 inches I'm actually able to film this video in peace because I switched my daughter's daycare to one that's actually right up the street it's five minutes away and um, cause usually um, on days that I'm not working, I ha I have to um I don't take her to daycare because her former daycare was like 30 minutes away, so it was actually taking me like an hour and a half to and from, and so it was getting frustrating for me. So I switched her daycare, and with her getting ready to start kindergarten, I needed to switch her daycare anyway. So I just actually did it earlier than later. Okay, so we're going to add our first layer here. I actually use um, my ATG because um, because this is pattern and it's really, really smooth. So I want to make sure that I have a really good stick. Okay, make sure that I have this nicely centered. Okay, this is actually the first layout that I, I have to say would probably be like my best work ever. I actually planned it. I um, planned it in the Cricut Craft Room, but I didn't use the Cricut Craft Room to cut it out. Um, but I like to use the Cricut Craft Room just to see how things will lay out. And so I have to say I'm really, really proud of it. I think this is the most real effort I really put into it. Okay, so then I cut out these two pieces using some gray cardstock and I embossed them with, um, I'm not sure, it's a Provo Craft um, Cutterbug um, embossing folder. I want to say it's called Pebbles, Small Pebbles. And so this is going to be my, um, like the sidewalk slash um, street. And what I did was, I cut it out at 11 inches, but I cut it in half because I knew it wasn't going to fit the whole embossing folder. 
And so that way, my next piece that's going to go on top of this will cover this piece here that did not get in, um, embossed. So once again, you really want to, because it's embossed, you really want to use a really good adhesive on it. And the dimension for this, um, for it is, um, as I said, it's 11 and a half and I cut it in, um, in half. I mean, it's 11 inches and I cut it in half. And, um, and then the height is two and a half inches. Okay, so I want to get this here on the end. I'm so happy that now um, YouTube allows us to do longer videos. Because I think before, maybe in the last year or two, in order to do long videos, it was a lot of people who were um, maybe really, really popular on um, on face. I mean, not on Facebook, on YouTube, and who had a lot of videos and a lot of viewerships that allowed them to do longer videos. Because if you remember. The minimum is about, it was 10 minutes, then they increase it to 15 minutes. And if it's over 15 minutes, you have to ask for special permission. It, it'll come up on your screen saying, hey, it's longer than 15 minutes. But now you can do a, um, um, but you can, if you hit this button and ask for permission, you can do longer videos. And I did that. So now people are allowed to do longer videos, um, without having any special requirements such as a lot of um, subscribers and viewership. Okay, so next here, I was going to do red, but I wanted to keep keep it with the theme of the paper pack. So I used this nice pink um, uh, foil sheet and it's going to go over right here. And this is going to be, instead of the red carpet, the pink carpet. I do not recommend taping on top of your project. Just because you can accidentally get tape on it on in a place that you really don't want to. Yeah, and this is two and a half by um by four inches. Okay, it looks even. Okay. So next I'm going to lay down my limousine, which is cut out. I used the Imagine to actually cut this out. So it was cut out at four and a half inches. But if you use your Cricut Craft Room, if you um, put your width to um, ten and um, like ten and a half or eleven, you'll get almost the same result. Also, okay. So that's gonna go right there. Then I have my prom dates. Aren't they just cute? My daughter was um, when my daughter saw that she wanted to play with it. And um, I had to stop her because on my little girl, I have um, I had liquid ice and I had just laid down liquid ice on it. Liquid glass. I'm sorry, not liquid ice, but liquid glass. So this is gonna go like at the bottom of the um, red carpet. So they're gonna be a little bit like, you know how we're sometimes just taller than a car. So. And I'm still trying to decide if I'm going to pop them up or not. I may not because it has a lot of dimension to it already. I just want to make sure. Okay. Actually, I might go ahead and pop them up. Just thinking about it. Okay. 
I'm going to go ahead and lay down some adhesive here. And then I took a little punch from Recollections, this punch, I'm not sure what the um, measurement is, and I cut and I punched out instead of having to cut out the circles here, and I just punched that out. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to lay that down here. And then let me grab a fresh pack of dimensionals. Okay. And I am going to pop Okay, and then I'm going to have to cut down so I can get his Okay, so I'm going to place them right there. And then I'm going to place her. I am really loving. Then I have my photo mat. So I took another piece of the foil um, cardstock and a piece of this green just to have it match up with my background. And this is cut out at four and a half by six and a half. And this piece is cut out at um, um, four and a quarter by six and a quarter. Oh, I meant to tell you, my two um, paper dolls are um, cu are cut out at five inches. Um, Erica, Erica, who also who runs the My Cricut Craft Room, she also she suggested uh, that when she uses paper dolls, not only just the teen ones, but any paper dolls, she cuts out at five um, five inches. Cause I know the the smaller you get, some pe certain pieces start to get smaller, and it gets a little bit harder. I find that particularly true with the Disney cartridges. Okay, so this is gonna go right there. I just put new tape in there not too long ago and it's already halfway gone. Let me see, do I want this slanted a little bit? Let's see, before I cement it down. I think that can work. Okay. Okay, then I'm going to go ahead and lay my picture down. I usually do not like showing earlier pictures of me. 
Because I went out to teenager, you know, I just feel like I went through the awkward phase. And then by my senior year, I started gaining weight. So. Okay, and then lastly, I have my um phrase. Sorry, let me make sure. Okay, it says senior prom, and I'm gonna lay that there, and I'm also gonna pop that up. Sorry that this video is so long, but I really hate editing. That's why I'm enjoying the fact that my daughter's in daycare. Because usually she comes into the room and I have to then do a lot of editing. And then those videos won't make it because of the editing. So that's why I haven't really been on YouTube lately. Okay, so then I'm going to put Senior Prom right up here. Okay, and there is let me try to make sure that you can see it. I will be taking a picture, and the picture will be a part of the video so you can really have a chance to see it but i want you to stop by my blog at stampingpearls.blogspot.com and to see the other projects that i'm going to be making using best friends and um baby um baby boutique and also to see what my other design team sisters have made for the block hop so hope to see you there